take four of this chapter. <sighs> I tell you, more and more distractions every day. There's my furry little distraction over there. She found the tissue box earlier. Yeah. Anyway, so, please open up your Bibles to chapter 26 of Isaiah. Hey, put that down. Okay, let's get started. In that day, this song will be sung in the land of Judah. We have a strong city. God will appoint salvation for walls and bulwarks. If you don't know what that city, what, uh, what that day is, and I'm talking about, go back to 24 and 25 of this, okay? Chapter 24, 25. All right, open the gates that the righteous nation which keeps the truth may enter in. You will keep him in perfect peace, uh, whose mind is stayed on you. You will keep him in perfect peace, whose mind is stayed on you. So you know, those who are focused on the Lord will find peace. Those who are not focused on the Lord but the things of this life, the things of the world, will not find peace. Okay, and at least not true peace. Okay, because he trusts in you, trust in the Lord forever. For in Yah, the Lord is everlasting strength. Okay, this is a good word here. For he brings down those who dwell on high, those who think they're better than everybody else. The lofty city, that he lays it low, he lays it low to the ground. He brings it down to the dust. The foot shall tread it down. What foot shall tread it down? This is interesting. Next verse here. Next sentence, actually. The feet of the poor and the steps of the needy. The very ones that the high and mighty oppressed. Okay, verse 7. The way of the just is uprightness. O, must, o most upright. You weigh the path of the just. Yes, in your way of judgments. O Lord, we have waited for you. We have waited for you. How many are waiting for the Lord? Are you waiting for the Lord? I am. Okay, the desire of our soul is for your name. How many desire for the Lord and his name? How many desire for his name? And for the remembrance of you. With my soul I have desired you in the night. He has desired him in the night, desired the Lord in the night. How many of us get up in the middle of the night to seek the Lord? Yes, by my spirit within me, I will seek you early, early in the morning. How many of us get up early to seek the Lord? For when your judgments are in the earth, the inhabitants of the world will learn righteousness. Let grace be shown to the wicked, yet he will not learn righteousness. In the land of uprightness, he will deal justly, unjustly, sorry, and will not behold the majesty of the Lord. Okay? Lord, when your hand is lifted up, they will not see, but they will see and be ashamed for their envy of people. Yes, the fire of your enemies shall devour them. Lord, you will establish peace for us, for you have also done all our works in us. Lord, O oh Lord our God, masters beside you have dominion over us. But by you only we make mention of your name. Okay. They are dead, they will not live. They are deceased, they will not rise. Therefore you have punished and destroyed them and made all their memory to perish. You have increased the nation, O Lord. You have increased the nation. You are glorified. You have expanded all the borders of the land. Lord, in trouble they have visited you. They poured out a prayer when your chastening was upon them. As a woman with child is in pain and cries out in her pangs when she draws near the time of her delivery. So we have been in your sight, O Lord. That's yes, in John 16:21. Okay, you can look there for that reference. Okay, we have been with child. We have been in pain. We all let's say we have, as it were, brought forth wind. We have not accomplished any deliverance in the earth, nor have the inhabit, ha, inhabitants of the world fallen. Okay, your dead shall live together with my dead body. They shall rise. This is Ezekiel 37:1 through 14. Also, um, you can hear something, see something similar of, of this manner of the dead resurrected in uh, Thessalonians. Okay, awake and sing, you who dwell in dust, for your dew is like the dew of her of herbs, and the earth shall cast out the dead. Come, my people, enter your chambers and shut the doors behind you. Are you listening, all you saints out there, the true saints who are truly serving the Lord, who are Holy Spirit filled? who actually truly, truly love the Lord and are waiting for Him, listen up. Come, my people, into your chambers and shut the doors behind you. Hide yourself, as it were, for a little moment until the indignation is past. For behold, the Lord comes out of His place to punish the inhabitants of the earth for their iniquity. The earth will also dis disclose her blood and no and will no more cover her slain. You know so all the rivers and the lakes and like the little mini seas and stuff are all turning blood red? 
I mean, all over the place. What was that river in Lebanon turned red, and then what was uh, that resort place in France, the water turned red there, and there was like red water in Texas, and I mean, just like all over for the last two years. So the earth will disclose her blood. Is that, what, is that what's going on? With all the water turning red? If you don't believe me, you know, just, just Google, you know, um, or look it up on YouTube, all the waters that have turned red, or Google it. You'll find it's very easy. There's, there's places all over. China, in the United States, several places. I think Russia had an incident of that. Europe, okay. So, um, yeah, even Japan, um, not too long ago, was it Ichihara City, not far from me? The water turned red there, too. Blood red. All right? So this is a sign to us. And they, you know, they don't have answers to it. It isn't like algae or something, you know? Many of these places, it, they don't have any answers to. So, you know. But, uh, you know, keep your eyes open. This is what's going down right now, okay? And for you saints out there, just lay low for a little while, okay? Speak out, you know, speak out the truth. But, you know, um, keep yourselves hidden a little bit, you know. So, in that day, the Lord with his se uh, severe sword, great and strong, this is, first, uh, tw this is chapter 27, will punish Le Le Leviathan. <laughs> I can't pronounce it right today. The Leviathan, the fleeing serpent. The devil. That serpent of old. Le Leviathan. Levi, ah, Leviathan, that twisted serpent, and he will slay the, the reptile that is in the sea. In that day, sing to her in a vineyard of red wine. I, the Lord, keep it. I water it every moment, lest any hurt it. I keep it night and day. Fury is not in me. Who would set briars and thorns against me in battle? I would go through them. I would burn them together. Or let him take hold of my strength. As if they could, you know. That he may make peace with me, and he may, may, and he shall make peace peace with me. Okay, we are grafted in. This is um, an important thing here. Those who come, he shall cause to take root in Jacob. Okay, is he talking about the Gentiles being grafted in? Those who come, sh he shall cause to take root in Jacob. Well, who's Jacob? Israel. Okay, so we'll be joined in with Israel. We'll become, you know, one of the branches of that tree there. Okay, Israel shall blossom and bud and fill the face of the world with fruit. He ha has he struck Israel as he struck those who struck him? Or has he been slain according to the slaughter of those who were slain by him? In measure, by sending it away, you contended with it. He removes it by his rough wind. In the day of the east wind, therefore by the iniquity of Jacob will be uh, will covered. Oh, sorry, therefore by this the iniquity of Jacob will, Jacob will be covered. And this is all the fruit of taking away, and I'm sorry. And this is all the fruit of taking away his sin, when he makes all the stones of the altar like chalk stones that are beaten to dust. Wooden images, incense altars shall not stand. Yet the fortified city will be desolate, the habitation forsaken and left like wilderness. There the calf will feed, and there it will lie down, and consume its branches. When his bows are withered, they will be broken off. Our boughs, sorry. When their boughs are <laughs> withered. They will be broken off. The women come and set them on fire, for it is a people of no understanding. For it is a people of no understanding. Okay? Therefore, he who made them will not have mercy on them, because they have no understanding. They choose to be ignorant. Okay? So, ignorance, is a lot of times, is a chosen thing. Alright? And he who formed them will show them no favor. And it shall come to pass in that day that the Lord will thresh from the channel of the river to the brook of Egypt, and you will be gathered one by one, O you children of Israel. So it shall be in that day the great trumpet will be blown. They will come, who are about to perish in the land of Assyria, and they who are outcasts in the land of Egypt. And they shall worship the Lord in the holy mount at Jerusalem. Okay, so I'm going to end it here for tonight. Okay. Um, at uh, chapter 27. So, I have to go now. I have to find out why the dog is being so suddenly quiet. So, um, I bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, and until next time, get in the Word of God. Also, keep praying, okay? Alright, goodbye. Night.